Washington softball team looked to take the brooms to Troy at home. The two teams played to 7-1 to scores. Both Louisiana wins. They faced off one more time in this series at high noon at Lampson Park. Cajuns had a couple of runners on in the bottom of the first when Sophie Piscos hits a sack fly to let Maddie Hayden score the game's first run. Second inning, Kayla Falterman jolts a pitch to left. Alexis Langliers would score, and Falterman would reach third on a triple. Later on, a Libby Baker wild pitch would let Falterman score for the Cajuns' third run. 5-0 in the bottom of the sixth, Hayden would score two more runs with a double. And then later on, Jordan Campbell puts a bow on the game and the series with a three-run home run. Cajuns win 10-zip in six innings. This weekend, I think we finally found a group of girls that know how to win a softball game and know how to play together and know how to get out there on the field and fight for each other and it showed in their effort. Um, I, I couldn't ask for anything this weekend that we didn't get. So I'm really glad that we're coming through and bringing the bats. That's what we're known for here and I feel like we've been doing a great job of seeing our bats, having quality at bats, scoring a lot of runs and stealing bases when we need to. I think offense as a whole has just been amazing this weekend. We have a big road trip coming up for the next two weeks, so being able to get a sweep at home was really good. I'm so proud of my team. Everyone did their job, and I think it's really important. It'll give us a lot of confidence going into this big road trip we have coming up. That road trip begins Tuesday night in Hammond against southeastern Louisiana in a non-conference showdown. After that, the Cajuns are in Mobile, Alabama for a three-game Sunbelt conference set against South Alabama starting on 